Hey everyone, it's Gabby from the Kia Hyundai channel. In today's video, I'm talking all about our digital rear view mirror, how you can configure it, and what it does in your brand new Kia or Hyundai vehicle. So first things first, it's located where your rear view mirror would be. To activate it, you're gonna flip this toggle over towards, oh boy. It can sometimes be terrifying, but let me tell you, this is a great safety function that really allows you to maximize, of course, what you see on the road and your cabin space. So I'm showing you a Carnival today. Carnival is one of our minivans. It's an eight-seater or seven-seater configuration. So if you're loading a vehicle like this up with passengers, especially taller ones, it may be hard to actually utilize your regular mirror. And of course, to toggle it on or off, it's super, super simple. However, where it's actually positioned may or may not work for you. So I'm going to show you how I can change that. Right over here on the right side, just right of the toggle, you have this square icon. Give it a push and it's gonna pull up the brightness and height tab. From there, I can select which one I'd like by pressing here. So this is gonna be our height. To either increase or decrease the height, I'm gonna use the left and right arrow. And you can see it moves very, very easily. Now, right now we're in a bit of a weird position because we're located in our video bay. However, you can already see we have almost six lanes worth of footage behind us. So if you're driving on a 400 series highway, country road, doesn't matter. You're gonna get a crystal clear view of everything that's back there as long as your camera is clean. And of course, you're not losing any functions because at the end of the day, it's still just a regular mirror if you want it to be. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and don't forget to leave a like and comment for more videos just like this. Oh, and uh, when we say subscribe, we're serious about that.